Hello student, welcome back. So here to in this session, we'll see uh, to write the program. Uh, this is exam question, write a program which will clear the screen, set the cursor at the particular location, prompt the message for you from Mr. John. Uh, you have like uh, uh, prompt, there is a message for you from Mr. John to read it, enter Y. Then if the user enters Y or Y, so lowercase Y or uppercase Y, then the message should be displayed. What is the message? Hi, I must leave the town tomorrow. Therefore, I will not be able to see you. Will appear on the screen. If the user enters any other key, then uh, there, there is a prompt. No more message for you should appear in the next line. So we'll see this one. Uh, title, some title you give, dot model small, dot stack, dot data. In dot data, first prompt. There is a message for you from Mr. John to read it enter Y. See here, there is a continuation of the message from first line to second line. At the end of the second line, you can see dollar symbol. That means uh, you can uh, you can continue the message uh, string uh, from one line to other line. Uh, you need not to see here, same string, uh, prompt one. This is a continuation of the string. Here there is no dollar. So continuation of the string. So this entire string is written in two line. So this one you have to remember. Then second message, uh, I'm, uh, that is on the next line, uh, line feed and carriage return is there. I must leave town tomorrow. Once again, continuation of the string. Therefore, I will not able to see you dollar. See you dollar. So dollar is the end of the string. Then uh, prompt, third message. There is no more message for you and dollar. Now what is carriage return and what is line feed? You can directly write 0DH and 0AH if you are interested or you can write separately like this. Now, now first one is initialization. Now call clear, clear the screen. You write the function clear screen. Then clear cursor, write the function to clear the cursor, same and set the cursor at the particular the, uh, this one uh, location coordinate then display the prompt what is the prompt uh, first message uh, what is the first message here you can see there is a message for you from the mr john to read it enter y so here you can see first uh, display the uh, prompt uh, i am moving the uh, offset address of the prompt to dx uh, and i will display that one uh, by using these three lines uh, then after this uh, to read the message uh, press s or uh, y or uh, lowercase y or uppercase y for that uh, to get that character from the user you have to use uh, input a uh, character input a character uh, 07 uh, input a character 07 within 21 h if you type these two lines uh, after execution of this uh, it waits for the user user to type the character uh, that is s or no and that will be stored in uh, al al now you have to compare al whether it is a lower case or upper case if it is a lower case uh, compare this one uh, with the uh, sorry upper case y if both are equal, jump, jump zero. If equal, if if user has pressed y, uppercase y, then uh, you are comparing that one uh, with the uh, this y, uppercase y means uh, normally it should give you zero. Jump on zero over, come here. Otherwise, uh, you compare whether user has typed lowercase y. That case also, if he has typed lowercase y, jump on zero over. Otherwise, uh, you display this message, uh, second message, uh, there is no any other uh, display second prompt, there is no any other message for you, this one. If user press Y or uh, lowercase Y, then it should display the other message, that is, I will, I, I will leave the town tomorrow, I will not be available to see you, those message, then uh, terminate the program. These are the routine for uh, clearing the screen and uh, set the cursor as we discussed in the previous session. So very important program this one. So with this uh, we have completed module 2 of MP.